all in all, uh, it was good to get outside, number one. It was good to get everybody back out here, the rookies and the veteran players included. You know, there's some good things. There's some things that we obviously need to get better at, and we'll continue to do that. Um, but I thought the uh, fundamentals and the uh, the execution, for the most part, were good. The guys were uh, they had a good pace, good work and pace going, and uh, kept the bodies off the ground, which we need to do. And, and uh, I thought we took a step forward today. I saw you camped out with the quarterbacks for the first part of the practice. What did you see? Well, I, you know, they were working with the, the receivers there and just talking uh, timing and, and uh, footwork. And it's good to get that uh, those two blended well together, right? So that's uh, we spent a lot of time doing that. Yeah. How's Alex grasping the <clears throat> offense so far? He's doing well. He, um, he seems to be picking things up uh, fairly easy. And uh, um, you know, I thought he executed, did a nice job with his execution today. So uh, very hard worker, very diligent. And I appreciate that. Is Chris all out here yet? No, what, Chris is a, a consultant, right. and uh, I brought him in uh, where he, he's actually been here once and, and visited with the defense and spent some time there. Uh, um, and he visited with Brad Childers for a little bit, and they went over some stuff. Uh, um, and he, he will not be here. Uh, he's not moving here. That's not what he's doing. He's living in Reno. And, uh, and I'm, I'm doing with him like I did with Tommy Brazier. Uh, for the last six years, and that was uh, uh, give them projects to do. And between he and Brad, they'll do they'll do that and um, uh, work together on that on, on some things. For do, you, do you see running the pistol at all? Is that an option? Going to be an option? Uh, well, it is an option. Well, but I mean, you know, literally. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, listen, we, we've done we do a little bit of everything, so that's what we've always done. Um, that's not we're not featuring that, but you know, we 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 mess around with a little everything. Coach, do you have an overall <laughs> message or theme you want to get across to this football team as you start? Well, uh, listen, I, I think hard work both in the classroom and, and uh, on the field I think are important, and they're willing to do that. Uh, that's what I've seen this offseason. And uh, when you do that and then you work your fundamentals, that's something that you can get out of these camps. Uh, uh, then that helps you once you put the pads on and, and things liven up once you get up to training camp. So, uh, uh, But for right now, uh, let's get let's get the system the system down both mentally and physically. Let's get it down, and, and then when we hit camp, we can hit camp running. <clears throat> Is there an attention to detail? Brandon? Go ahead. Can you talk a little bit about Brandon being here and his presence and now having Eric and Brandon there, and you can visually see them on the field as you work out? Yeah, listen, I thought both of them did a did a nice job. Today. I was curious to see uh, both of them in there. I thought Brandon came back in in good shape, and we we moved a, a pretty fast clip today, and and he was able to hang in there and and. You know, looked like he held his own, and then um, Eric. I, I thought he did a nice job with the ones. Uh, he was in working with the first group. Uh, we're lucky we have Donald Stevenson here to to be able to swing back and forth. He can also play guard for us, so he got reps everywhere. And, and uh, you need all of them. Uh, that's an important position. But it was good to see those two. Yeah, that, that was a good thing. Is there an attention to detail that you're stressing, like the several times that you? yelled at the guys to get get off the playing field itself. Is that just something early on you want to stress that the little details are well, important? Listen, you, yeah, you, you, listen, little things are they're very important. And, and uh, the little things add up if you don't take care of them and become big things. So uh, we're going to make sure that we we focus on those and we're not going to let those things slide. Uh, the players don't want that. Uh, they don't want the things to slide. They're, they're trying to do it the right way. And they're, uh, that's the way they've approached it since, since I've been here. And uh, you know, that's a tribute to Romeo and, and Scott Pioli and for things that they taught them to build a foundation there, and we're trying to build on that. Andy, what are your thoughts about where you are at wide receiver? Uh, we, we've got a, a group of guys, and uh, they're, they're working very hard. I, I, I don't mind playing a bunch of wide receivers. I, that's, a, uh, that's what you do, keep them fresh so you can throw fastballs out there. And, and uh, we, we've got a variety. We've got some speed guys, some smaller, quick guys. We've got big, strong guys and kind of those intermediate guys, and um, and, and that's okay. We work, we'll work to all their strengths and uh, uh, allow them to make plays. A couple more guys. Yeah, Andy, you've got Akeem Jordan in there in the middle. Can you talk about what he brings, what you see in him? Because he played in the 4-3 there, and just kind of yeah. talk about his adjustment. Yeah, well, the thing you get with Akeem, he's a smart football player, and uh, he hasn't played in the 34, uh, but you, he gives you the trust that he can, he can do that. He's a good, solid football player is what he is, and. He doesn't make a lot of mistakes, and he's a phenomenal special teams player. Okay. So you, you get, uh, you know, you get both those things. You're gonna get a guy that doesn't make mistakes on the field as, as a linebacker, and then you, you really, you really get something special there on special teams. Yeah, there's reports out that Donovan McNabb's gonna retire in Eagle the day, of course, that you guys go in there to play. What are your thoughts on that? 
Well, I'm okay with that. You know, Donovan and I talked about that, and uh, I, I'm I'm all for it. I, you know, I, he's a special guy, and and uh, I'm I'm glad he's retiring as an eagle for for the first thing, and uh, I'm glad they're they're going to give him a celebration because he deserves every bit of that. He he's a uh, he's just tremendous, good person, and a great football player, and uh, I had a lot of fun with him. You, I thought, you, you don't mind coaching those guys, right? What, <laughs> what do you anticipate from <clears throat> that game, the reception? I know it's early. But. Well, I told I told Donovan and Doc and all those guys they had to run out of the tunnel with me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here's the most important question. Is Taco Tuesday going to live here in Kansas City? Well, you know, I wasn't uh, I wasn't really a taco. The junk food Friday now? Yeah, right. Yeah, well, that, that'll, Friday, that'll right. live. But the taco, I wasn't big on the Taco Tuesday as much as I was the junk food Friday. But, you know, that's all right. Um, uh, that, that that one will live. The Taco Tuesday, that wasn't my deal. Um, I'm, I'm glad they're giving me credit for it, but that wasn't my deal. What's on the menu for Junk Food Friday? Well, we'll have to bring you some. We'll have to bring you some. You, you'll, about, you'll like it. How about barbecue? It's a barbecue. Yeah. Well, we, yeah, listen, we, we do the barbecue. That's part of that's part of Junk Food Friday. We, we have a little barbecue. Yeah. 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 Andy, with regard to the offensive line, when do you want to find your five guys and just go with them? Or, or have you done that already? Are the five guys you had out there today, are those going to be your five? Well, those are the five right now. I'm going to play the five best guys. And uh, right now, those are the five, and they're working together to get better. Uh, we've rotated uh, Donald Stevenson in there mm -hmm. to uh, both the guard and the tackle spots. Uh, um, you know, when we really get rolling there to, to get some reps. Uh, so, but the guys you see there are the five.